The successful launch of ESA's Gamma Ray Satellite Integral on 17 October 2002 opens new perspectives. The successful launch of ESA's Gamma Ray Satellite Integral on 17 October 2002 opens new perspectives for this line of research and for our understanding of galactic black holes. The successful launch of ESA's Gamma Ray Satellite Integral on 17 October 2002 opens new perspectives for this line of research and for our understanding of galactic black holes. As Felix Mirabel puts it, thanks to Integral we're expecting to find the successful launch of ESA's Gamma Ray Satellite Integral on 17 October 2002 opens new perspectives for this line of research and for our understanding of galactic black holes. As Felix Mirabel puts it, Thanks to Integral, we're expecting to find many more black holes. We'll track the their successful paths launch in the Milky of ESA's Gamma Ray Satellite in Integral on 17 October 2002 opens new perspectives for this line of research and for our understanding of galactic black holes. As Felix Mirabel puts it, thanks to Integral, we're expecting to find many more black holes. We'll track their paths in the Milky Way and get. The successful launch of ESA's Gamma Ray Satellite Integral on 17 October 2002 opens new the perspectives. Successful launch the of ESA's Gamma Ray Satellite Integral on 17 October 2002 opens new perspectives for this line of research and for our understanding of galactic black holes. As Felix Mirabel puts it. Thanks to Integral, we're expecting to the find many more black holes. Successful launch of ESA's Gamma Ray Satellite Integral on 17 October 2002 opens new perspectives for this line of research and for our understanding of galactic black holes. As Felix Mirabel puts it, thanks to Integral, we're expecting to find ESA's Gamma Ray Satellite Integral on 17 October 2002 opens new perspectives for this line of research and for our understanding of galactic black holes. As Felix Mirabel puts it. Thanks to Integral, we're expecting to find many more black holes. We'll track the, the successful launch of ESA's Gamma Ray Satellite Integral on 17 October 2002 opens new perspectives for this line of research and for our understanding of galactic black holes. As Felix Mirabel puts it, thanks to Integral, we're expecting to find many more black holes. We'll track their paths in the Milky Way and gain insight into their birthplace. The successful place. launch of ESA's Gamma Ray Satellite Integral on 17 October 2002 opens new perspectives for this line of research and for our understanding of galactic black holes. As Felix Mirabel puts it, Thanks to Integral, we're expecting to find many more black holes. We'll track their paths in the Milky Way and gain insight into their birthplace and how they formed.